Hello, welcome back. This is Kenshin 1913, and we are Let's Playing Dragon Ball Z Legend of the Super Saiyan. In the last episode, we um <clears throat> we defeated the Ginyu Force. Goku took him on. As you can see, my battle power is a lot higher. I'm not at max yet, but uh, eventually I'll get there. At the enemies that I'm fighting now, it's gonna take too damn long. So I figure out let's continue on with the story. So let's use the Dragon Ball radar to find the Dragon Balls, which I believe are up here. So everyone now, their battle power is equivalent to... their battle power is equivalent to, uh, a Ginyu. Even Chaozu can fight Captain Ginyu. Yeah, we have these Zarbon guys. Hopefully everyone can one-shot everyone. That's what I'm looking forward to. And I'm just gonna... As you can see, took two damage. And yeah, so Krillin... Well, this is the animation that they can do. Now they can really wail at him. Now that we're at a new level of power. And there we go. Yeah, I'm just gonna fast forward through certain parts. Yeah, Tien, look at him. Kicking him through mountains, destroying every mountain in Namek. Namek is just basically a battleground planet at this point. Shit, I feel bad for him. Yeah, but pretty much do the same thing. I always felt bad for Namek during the show because they really got the raw deal. You know what I mean? They got a raw deal. They got their planet torn apart by Frieza's men, pretty much killing everyone. Alright, so it's directly south. Well, let's go directly south. Yeah, they're gonna run off scared. Alright, so I don't know if these are new enemies, but I'll show them regardless. Let's see, Krillin, let's show off Solar Flare. Yeah, for the computer when you're fighting these guys, um, there's no reason to have Vegeta use anything, but if you're, like, just fast-forwarding and doing auto, Vegeta will always get the key attack, which really sucks. Can I attack or what? Yeah. Solar Flare! Oh, the evasion's half, that's all it does. So, yeah, apparent. yeah, as you can see, they're so strong. Go on is so strong, you can just kill everybody one hit, luckily. I'm just gonna show these battles because they're so goddamn easy. Hmm, I guess I do have to go that way. Anyways, I know we're gonna have to fight Frieza soon because pretty much all of his, uh. All of his guys are dead. Anyone, anyone who's gonna get away. Ain't, also, another thing interesting is, since you have a bad guy in your group, sort of, I guess, you technically, I guess you call Vegeta bad guy. The thing about him is he'll actually use, let's do, uh, pretty, pretty sure I showed off most of this. But, uh, yeah, the thing about... The thing about... Oh, so Vegeta being a bad guy, if anyone tries to run off, any of the bad, any of the evil dudes, if they run off, um, Vegeta will attack them. Most of the time he will kill them. Eventually we will, we will be running into, uh, Carbon copies of the Ginyu Force. Pretty much Sprite, uh, whatever, you know. 
what do they call them? Sprite uh, copies or whatever. So here it is, Frieza. And we can't look at this this guy's attack, so let's just take him on. He's hiding in a cave. And let's see how we do. I mean, we are just so powerful. Now let's see how strong Frieza is. Hmm. Look at that, we're destroying Frieza. Frieza is no match for me. I thought he was this all-powerful bad guy. Apparently he's not. We just killed the shit out of him. Oh, he was one of those Cybermen. Yeah, it wasn't exact. So let's take the Dragon Balls. Ah, shit, I gotta use items. I forgot about that. Now let's use Chi-Chi's. I can always buy these, I guess. Damn, man. I loaded up on these and I forgot that I was gonna get these. Oh, we got some Gokus, too. Might as well make everything a key card. Sorry, Dad, you know. There we go, now we got all the Dragon Balls. Now I think we just have to bring them... You go yourself. Everyone will stand back. This should kill everybody. And look at that. I, don't have to, I can do that. Vegeta reached uh, level 46. The highest level I think is 47, 48, I think. So yeah, look at Vegeta. He's almost got a million battle power. So let's get the hell out of here. Alright, let's walk on out. Alright, let's keep going. Namekian dragon will finally be summoned. Yay! What's the password? Yep, so now Nail is gonna take... is gonna... is gonna have to... yeah, cuz... I think Frieza came over here to get, like, something from this guy. I forget. And Dende's gonna go help summon the dragon. Now Frieza's gonna... fight. So now... they're gonna fly to a different spot. Yeah, Frieza's kinda... nice in that aspect, I guess. Now it's time to take on Frieza. Let's see. Oh, I do have a... Alright, cool. Let's use one of these. Because I want to do something here. If possible. Make that a double Z card. If we can actually do some damage to him, I think we get a Parunga card. Which is basically the, uh... The, um, what do they call it? The, uh, if we can do any damage to this guy, we'll get a card. Alright, we did. Alright. I wish I could look at his, uh, battle power. Alright. 
right, let's, uh... Let's see, another one. Wait, 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 Goku. Use another Goku. I wish you could use another Guru, but you can't. Because he's already got it. So let's use a Goku. On that one. And pick a Chi Chi. And then it, see, this is what I'm gonna do at the end of the game too. I gotta buy some more cards. All right, now attack him. Cause all we're doing is trying to uh, stall for time here. Oh man. I think you have to last, like, so many turns with this guy. Oh, different energy beams for different levels. Ah, uh, yeah, he, he took six damage. So we could probably defeat Frieza if we uh, had enough time, but... He's pretty pissed off now. Turn it. Nice. And if we get a uh, Dragon Ball from Frieza, or we get this stuff from Frieza, we can actually get a cool, you know, the the Namekian dragon. Alright, let's use... do I have any healing? Nope. Except for Shenron? What the hell, I don't care. There we go, nail. Two damage. Do we have him yet or what? So yeah, as you can see, Nail is really no match in the long term, as you can see. Yeah, as you can see, Nail... I'm not healing him this time. I don't know how many turns we're supposed to last with this guy. Let's do a save state just in case. One more for good measure. Hmm, whatever, let's do another one. Alright, Nail's been killed. while the Earthlings summon the dragon. Yeah, that's right, you're gonna kill us all, but we're gonna summon the dragon. And Gohan got Dende. So we're gonna summon the dragon Purunga. And Vegeta actually at this point was taking a nap, yeah. And now we're gonna summon the dragon far away from Vegeta so that he can't get immortality. And now we summon the Namekian dragon, Purunga. And unlike the other dragon, he's a massive looking guy. And he can actually grant three wishes. He wants to revive all the people killed by Vegeta and Nappa. Uh, the card Purunga or the moon card? Let's ask for the Purunga card. We didn't get that third wish. Oh, Warp Piccolo.
The only thing we had to do was wish for immortality, and then we could have killed this with Frieza. But now Frieza's gonna come and kill us. So there we go. We could have wished for the moon card, but it's not worth it because there's no reason for the Namekian uh, thing. Anyways, let's land. And let's look at our stats. Did we go up any levels? No. Alright, let's see one other thing. We got a card. You can make three wishes, so I'll do that. I actually... You know what? Let's destroy you guys. Let's do a save state and find out what the wishes can be. Because that's a good uh, item. Oh, we have to use it in battle? Alright. Alright, then we'll just use it in battle. I'm not exactly sure what I'm looking for. Make all the cards level up a person. Awesome, okay, so that's not too bad. Maybe I'll use it for... When I have one guy left to level up or something. But I'd like to use that against, like, Frieza or something. Oh, well. Alright, we got a Scouter. Yeah, I'm not sure where the, uh, Frieza is now. We got. I think we gotta find him or something. Yeah, because if we use the Dragon Radar, there's nothing anymore. Do we have to go meet the Guru? Is that it? And okay, here's some new enemies, the guys that look like the Ginyu Force. Luckily, they're dead, and that is not Raccoon. But we kill them all, all, all the same. And boom. Yeah, see, look at the experience we get. Way more. A lot better. Anyways, let's stop right here. Come in here. Talk to you. Zell. Um. Sell for 150, but it is good. Now let us buy. This isn't the place where we can buy... There will be a place where we can buy Goku and Vegeta. Uh, Goku and someone else cards. So now what am I looking for? Am I looking for Piccolo? Yeah, these are Ginyu guys, and we're beating them pretty handily. Luckily, we get a lot more experience. Which will help me level up. these guys, huh? Alright, so what I'm gonna end up doing is I'm gonna stop the video and I'm gonna level up and then I'm gonna find out where where I need to go. Let's see, is this the guy who sells the good stuff? What I'm gonna end up doing now is probably gonna stop, like I said, stop the video, level up, and, uh, I don't know, find out where to go in the next episode. So, yeah, let's just finish this and, and yeah, as you can see, we get some nice cards, come on, alright, yeah, forget it, I'm stopping here. So this can get to 1913, let's see you in the next episode. Hopefully everyone will be leveled up to their their max, which is 48, 49 or something like that. As you can see, let's see if I can find a character. Yeah, so like 20,000 experience you need, and then the last level is like a ton of experience. So what I'm going to do is just, like I said, level up, and I'll be back later. So this has been Kenshin 13. See you later. Bye-bye.